Jacob Rees-Mogg has walked with his eyes wide open into this and still holds you in such low regard. That's the bit I can never get past. Because when you finished thinking about the last two years, when you finished recalling where the clarity and leadership were, how much clarity and leadership was displayed. Do you remember him accusing Keir Starmer of wanting to cancel Christmas and making great play out of calling him Captain Hindsight and then reversing his original decisions and uh, U-turning on pretty much everything under the sun? And Jacob Rees-Mogg thinks you are so stupid that when he says Boris Johnson has got all the big decisions right, you're going to go along with it. How stupid must he think you are? I suppose the gravest insult that he could inflict upon you is that he thinks you're as stupid as he is. Because if he really, really believes this, then there's a very real danger of his single brain cell dying of loneliness. But he thinks you are so stupid, so thick, so blinded by binary party loyalty, so deferential, so... Ah, so defined by your low social class or your status that you will actually buy the steaming pile of crap that he just served up to you while ostensibly being the leader of the House of Commons. Boris Johnson has got all the big decisions right. And that in response to revelations that he had a birthday party when you couldn't even go to a loved one's funeral. How stupid does he think you are? Just have a little think about that.